What's up guys, it's Boss here, and as you saw by the title, we are going to be doing not one, but two intro packs for Magic the Gathering. So the first one we have here, it says Desperate Stand. Magic the Gathering intro pack, and it's the one card that you get. Moon is Vanguard, Oath of the Gatewatch, and then the other one we have is a Swarming Instinct Magic the Gathering intro pack. And the card you can see is Genre of Hope, Battle for Zenkar. As you guys can see right here, I have been making some butterfly knives. I have three currently right now. This is a little test one. This is this the real the real one that involves skill. And this one is more of a fun like Team Fortress 2 like. But I can do some tricks. This one. Pretty easy. Okay. And we also have some protection sleeves that I got at GameStop. Okay. So, first one we will be opening is this Swarming Instinct. It's a water green forest type. And then let's get right into it. Here's what this box is that holds all of everything. And here's what the intro pack looks like unopened. Put that off to the side. So you, it comes with two booster packs. Battle for Zenkar, Weird Serpent Person, and a Gideon. Here is the things that tells you about the creatures you get. And this is a reference card that tells you like parts of a turn. All that. Okay. So, we are going to open this, and then we're going to save these, and then, and then we're going to open this, take out the boosters, open the deck, and then we're going to save up these two to make it four. So, I'll have four boosters to open up in this video. Here's that drawn out of hope. Take an extra look. Very nice. So this is a water forest type. Okay. Drawn out of hope. Desolation twin. Blister pod. Two, three. Tide drifter. I'm gonna try and go through these fast. Here are the floors. Okay, and we're on to the artifacts and instants. Ooh. 
why I have that. It's a lot. Okay. On to the next intro pack. This one is a is a light skull type. These are the two. Sorry. These are the two of my favorite types. And here are the two oath of Gatewatch. Some girl and other. Same thing. This tells you the cards you get. And then we have them, and the card, and the Vanguard. Planes. Smart. Ooh. Okay. Put that off to the side. And here is what we're going to do. Okay. So let's hope we get another ditty and that'll be nice. Or a plain walker. Any. Or even Zendikar. I don't know if that's a card. I'm just gonna scan through these. Looks nice. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's like a full art almost. Oh, that's that lady on Oath of Gatewatch. Ooh, and a nice looking planes, a nice looking mountain, and a night ally. Wow, that looks nice. Those are both nice. Let's put them in the back here. And we have Moran Shepherd. That was nice. Oath of the Gate Watch. Another core. See, that's Jace right there, that dude. And we have Hissing Quagmire <laughs> Island in a night alley again. That's a funny name. That was the Zender card. Who are in that? And we have. Shrine of Forsaken Gods. 
a nice swamp again and a rash of sea on. Okay, on to the final pack Earth of the Great Watch. And we have, oh, Elf of N Nisa. That looks nice. Flames and Eld Razi Sion. But that. Nice. Okay. Put this aside. Let's do a recap. So we got a full art mountain. Then we had a nice hollow basic land full art as I think. Shrine of Forsaken Gods, it's a land. Another land, Hissing Quagmire. A, an angel, Emira Shepherd. And Oath of Nisa. Okay, that'll be it you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Tell your friends about me. See you. And see you guys next time. Bye.